Hi everyone. So, uh, Lakme has recently launched Enrich Matte Lipsticks. These are available in uh, more than 20 shades. And uh, <coughs> please ignore the background noise. I cannot do anything about it. There's a construction going on in the back, in the building next to us, and it's like going on for almost like three months now. And uh, so, Lakme has recently launched their Enrich Matte Lipsticks. These are available in 24 shades and uh, i got a chance to uh, test them out i was sent four shades and then i bought four uh, four others and uh, to test them out and do this uh, swatch come review video so uh, these lipsticks come in this kind of uh, packaging i do not like the packaging because it looks more like a tester to me and this packaging is quite flimsy one of the lipsticks came off uh, completely out completely out of the packaging i have to glue it back then uh, the, the packaging looks very similar to the Enrich Matte uh, Enrich Satin lipsticks, uh, and uh, the texture of these lipsticks is matte, but they apply like very smoothly on the lips. They feel very comfortable and moisturizing. Uh, however, the pigmentation is not uh, uniform across the board. The lighter shades tend to look flaky and crumbly, whereas the darker shades are like more smooth, have a more smooth finish and more even finish. Uh, the pigmentation also varies from shades to shades. In fact, all out of all the four, eight shades that I own, only one shade uh, lacks pigmentation. Rest, all the shades are packed with pigments. Uh, I do not have any any uh, issues in terms of the staying power as well. They stay on for a really long time. Even the pink shades uh, like PM11, PM10, they stayed on me for good uh, seven plus hours, and they stain. They leave a very strong stain. And your lips don't feel very dry. This is a matte formula, so you just cannot expect it to be very forgiving. So uh, you have to make sure that your lips are well exfoliated and prepped before you apply this lipstick. It stays on for a really long time. Uh, one one issue that I faced was that one of the bullets uh, broke completely from the base. I guess it's it happens when the formula is like very matte. Uh, the the bullet doesn't stay on uh, for a long time. I don't know how to put it forward. But it's okay, I glue it back, the bullet also I glue it back. Uh, the, uh, the only con that I could find was the scent. I do not like the scent of these products. Uh, they are like, it smells almost like a strong cough syrup. And uh, also I do not like the packaging, but for 275 you just cannot complain much, right? So the product is good. Uh, I like the product. I don't have much complaint. Uh, there is a thing that you should make sure that your lips are really nicely prepped so that the formula goes on really smoothly otherwise it will look patchy uh, I do not I haven't faced the issue of it moving out of the lip lines and all so it's good in pigmentation it's good in staying power uh, the formula is good and comfortable it's not flat drying matte but it's not creamy either so it's like a cross in between it's like a cross and it's somewhere in between a matte and a cream finish so it feels very comfortable on the lips there are a lot of shades to choose from and uh, yeah that's all so let's start the swatches now
enjoyed these swatches if you uh, did do not forget to give this video a big big thumbs up and uh, I'll see you very very soon in my next video also if you're watching me for the first time please take a moment and subscribe to my channel so that you do not miss out on any such uh, swatch videos in future and um, I'll see you very very soon in my next video till then bye